I would like to congratulate all of our graduating students. Graduation is the most exciting event of the academic year, and all of the deans and faculty of the School of Medicine and Dentistry and the Eastman Institute for Oral Health are disappointed that we could not share commencement with you in person. In the past years, I have spoken about the need to transform the healthcare system and the important role that you as our newest and best educated clinicians, researchers, and educators would play in that transformation. However, this is an unusual year and it has brought new attention and I believe new understanding of the complexities involved in healthcare. Dealing with diseases like COVID-19 takes more than a smart app. It means teams of physicians, nurses, and advanced practice providers from the University of Rochester going to Long Island to help Northwell Health deal with an unimaginable number of critically ill patients. It means early medical school graduates throughout New York State signing up to help fight the pandemic. It means doctors and nurses providing psychological support to critically ill patients unable to be visited by their families and loved ones. It means researchers working in the basic laboratories to get a better understanding of the COVID-19 virus so that we can develop new strategies to combating this virus. And researchers engaging in clinical trials to test the best current approaches to treating the disease. It means experts in oral health, public health, and epidemiology helping to model and guide us in how best to limit the spread of the infection. And every day we are redefining the concept of teamwork. We have quickly broken down our silos and have tackled this disease as a united family of clinicians, researchers, and educators all focused on the best way to treat this illness. It is heartening to experience the show of support that we are receiving all around the globe. Whether it is people shouting thank yous at seven o'clock from their apartments in Manhattan, to blinking their car lights and honking their horns outside of Strong Memorial Hospital or St. James Hospital in Hornell to show their appreciation. Medical science has made huge advances in treating and curing disease and continues to do so at a dizzying pace. 100 years ago, the life expectancy in the United States was 55. Today, it is 79. And the quality of life among the older population has also markedly improved. Together with the revolution in information and technology, and working collaboratively among specialties. We have tools at our disposal to improve the health of our patients that could never have been imagined 100 years ago. Yet with it all, this pandemic has made it clear that there is still much to learn. As graduates of the University of Rochester, you have been trained at an institution where our approaches to education should position you best to be the next generation of leaders, whether it be in clinical care, research, or education. I am exceedingly proud of our graduates and proud that the University of Rochester has given you the foundation to make a difference and to take health in the 20th century, true to the university's model Meliora, to something ever better. I congratulate you again on your current success and I look forward to your future achievements.